Hey, what's up guys? It's Crafty Fox, and today we're going to be building the Alstom PL42AC. Now, this is a diesel electric locomotive. It's quite big, and it's for New Jersey Transit, which is a commuter rail in New Jersey. Here's what it looks like, and you can use this to pull uh, model level and bi-level coaches. I see this is like one concept you can pull off. And here is another PL42AC. Uh, you can see that in the Bound Brook animation. If you haven't already seen it, go check it out. But anyways, let's get started. So first off, we're gonna take out gray concrete and place that two blocks above the ground or the tracks, I mean. Let's make it um, three blocks wide like so. And we're gonna make this segment 32 blocks long. So take this, extend it out 32 blocks. So like this, I extended it 32 blocks. Now we're gonna take out nether brick stairs go underneath the front and add three blocks wide like that now on the sides we want to have upside down another brick stairs let's face that outwards towards the side and another upside down one facing the front above it like so and then in the middle of that we want three blocks wide um, clay like this then on the side over here let's add um, stone brick stairs facing the back and on the inner part of that we're going to add three blocks wide clay again and then we're going to make the, this u shape using clay right behind it like so and then we're going to go back to the front add another brick stairs facing outwards and in the middle we want to have black concrete with upside down another brick stairs facing outwards on the side of that and in the middle of that let's add a birch fence gate open that up on top we're going to add a stone slab with white carpet on either side of it then we're going to add black glass right behind the carpet like so in the middle we're going to add two blocks of clay with stone slab on the side of that behind that let's add three blocks wide clay and on top, we're going to make a T-shape of stone slab like that. All right, and behind that, we're going to add three blocks wide, nether brick um, slabs. And then we want cobblestone slab on the sides, nether brick slab in the middle. And then we're going to add um, five nether brick slabs. So one, two, three, four, five, make it three blocks wide. so and then we're going to add four cobblestone slabs on the sides at so one two three four and the middle is going to be nether brick slabs all right then we're going to go back to the front let's add um black wool in between inside this u-shape like that all right and then we're going to add in um, black concrete over here and another one diagonally up and skip a block add another one here and let's add an iron bar right there same thing on the other side so add these two black uh, concrete diagonally and then skip one add another one here and then iron bars for the side view mirror now on the side we're going to add uh, another brick stairs facing outwards um, one like that and another one diagonally up but it's facing the front same thing on the other side and then we want to curve it around so we're going to add two more uh, nether brick stairs like that same thing on the other side and then on the side we're going to add a gray glass block inside for that side window and then right down below we're going to add two uh, dark uh, dark oak wood buttons like that probably says New Jersey Transit and we are going to also add one in the front as well all right all right then we're going to move down and add in the bogey so go over here let's add a three by three of nether brick uh, slabs right behind the front then we're going to add the wheels using black wool and then we're going to add another uh, three by three nether brick slabs in the middle and the other pair of wheels black wool another big slab in between inside then we're going to add in uh, hoppers on the side of the wheels 
So go add that right now. Just the side, and we're also going to add um, acacia wood slab behind the first um, hopper, and then another brick slabs for the other parts. Same thing on the other side. Hoppers inside the wheels, acacia wood slab in the front, and then two nether brick slabs after that. All right. And then we're going to go to the back and we're going to skip three blocks. Let's add a pair of wheels using uh, black wool. Sorry, move that like that. And then we're going to add a three by, you know what? Let's make a three by five. I think it sticks out all the way. So, three blocks long, five blocks wide. And then we're gonna add another pair of wheels. And let's add another brick slab in between. And then hoppers on the side of all the wheels. Like so. All right. And then we're gonna go to the back and add a two by five of dark oak wood trap doors underneath. Right at the tip. Gonna be sticking out. And let's add two uh, gray concretes on either side. Like that, let's go back to the front. Let's add gray concrete and dark oak wood trapdoor underneath. Same thing on the other side. All right, so back over here, let's take out uh, nether brick stairs, add one upside down here, nether brick slab, and uh, three nether brick stairs facing outwards. And then actually the third one's gonna be facing the back. And then we're gonna have uh, another brick stairs facing outwards and another one facing the back like that. All right, same thing on the other side. Upside down stairs, a slab, and then two another brick stairs facing outwards and then one facing the back. And then one facing outwards and one facing the back again. Let's go back to the other side. That's gonna be upside down stairs facing the front and then a stairs facing outwards and another one facing the front and then facing outwards and then this one's facing backwards and then one facing outwards again and I believe yeah that's it and then another brick slab right there same thing on the other side just copy it stairs um, <laughs> yeah upside down facing the front outwards and then facing the front then outwards again, then facing the back, and then facing outwards, and then a slab. So then we're gonna add eight nether brick stairs. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Same thing on the other side. All right. And then on this side, we're gonna add an upper nether brick uh, slab like that. But on this side, it's gonna be a nether brick stairs upside down like that. Then I'm going to add another brick slabs all the way across, fill in this gap here, like so. And in between where we had these stairs, we're going to have uh, another brick slab like that all the way across. It's going to be on the inner portion, and same thing on the other side. And we want to connect it so it's like a giant box in the middle, like so. All right, so over here, we're going to change it up to a stone brick slab. So skip one away from the wheel. Let's add uh, four stone brick slabs like that. Let's make it three blocks wide so it matches the other side. Like so. Then we're going to delete these four blocks of the slabs right above the slabs and add um, eight of these stone brick slabs like that. On the other side, there's going to be three stone brick slabs in the front. Don't delete anything else, like so. Then we're going to go move over here. Let's add three smooth uh, stone blocks like that. And acacia um, stairs on top. Then there's going to be three uh, clay blocks. And then nether brick stairs. Same thing on the other side. Just copy it, three st smooth stone, K-shift stairs, three clay, and then another brick stairs. All right. Then on the actual door, we're going to have uh, two stone buttons like that. And then um, two orange glass panes on either side for 
the railings. Same thing on the other side, like so. And then we're going to add a um, birch wooden button on the side of that black concrete. And in the front, we're going to add in uh, these two stone buttons, like so. The middle, we're going to add a coupling using uh, another brick slab with a dark oak wood fence gate and acacia fence gate. So acacia is going to be on the outside part, dark oak wood on the inside part, and open them all up. And uh, then we're going to add in uh, clay right behind that upside down um, stairs in the front like that. Cover that up. Then we're going to move on to the back. Let's add a coupling using dark oak wood slab like that. And dark oak wood fence gates, open that up on either side of that. And then acacia wind buttons on the side of that. And then we're going to add five blocks wide clay. And then we're going to add an iron door in the middle with two block tall clay walls on either side of it. Alright, on top of that, we're going to add three blocks wide of black concrete. And let's add another brick stairs on the side of that like so. Then we're going to add three blocks long of cobblestone wall and then um, another brick uh, stairs and then three cobblestone walls again and then we're going to repeat the same thing on the other side like so and then um, then we're going to take out <laughs> cobblestone slabs and another brick slab. Let's place another brick slab first, so three blocks wide in the back. And in the middle, let's go all the way across using another brick slabs, like so. And the parts where we have the cobblestone stairs already, just place the cobblestone slab diagonal to that. And another brick slab in the middle. So we got these giant vents. And I wanted to make it a different color so it like pops out. Alright, so the next thing we're going to do, we're going to go over here towards the front behind the cab. We're going to add a double stone slab. Then we're going to take a blue concrete powder and we're going to add five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're going to add magenta concrete powder at five. One, two, three, four, five. And then orange powder, we're going to add six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we're going to add a double um, stone slab like that. And do the same thing on the other side, but we're going to do something different. We're going to flip the pattern so it's orange first. So six orange, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then five magenta, one, two, three, four, five. And then five blue, one, two, three, four, five. And then double stone slab. Now, after we do that, we're going to take a stone slab and we're going to make like this wall across. So it's going to be really, really tall like that just a bunch of stone brick. I guess two blocks tall all the way across to the other side so just fill all this area in it's gonna take quite a while all right so it should look like this now we would go over here to where this door is and we're gonna add an acacia fence gate that's opened up like that on the side same thing on the other side open that up and then we'd go to the roof area and we're gonna place um, three cobblestone stairs on the side one two three and then another brick stairs and then uh, four cobblestone stairs and we would add another brick stairs all the way across to the other side then we're going to take another brick slab add it on the inner wall like this or rather the roof and same thing on the other side, so three cobblestone walls here, or stairs, and then another brick. Then four cobblestone, and then another brick stairs all the way across. Then another brick slabs on the very top, all the way across. And you can fill in the middle as well for another brick. Like so. Alright, so next we're going to go on the top where this uh, cobblestone stairs ends and then we're going to add two nether brick slabs like that for the top vent then we're going to go to the next one uh, the block right before that or after that I mean in the middle we're going to add four 
nether brick slabs on the very top right there in the middle and for these back vents they're going to be a little different we're going to place uh, another brick slab here and then we're going to replace the slab after with uh, stairs so it looks like that and then the next one is going to be um, replace that with the stairs and then a slab on top and then skip this block here and add a slab and then replace this one behind it with a stairs so it should look like that then we're going to add in this compartment over here we're going to add two clay blocks and then I need smooth stone I don't have it let me grab it we're going to make a two by two at the bottom and then we're going to go to the back here and add upside down uh, stone brick stairs like that same thing on the other side and let me check if that doors there yep that same exact thing with the clay on top and now for um, this section over here we you know we want to have like the double uh, stone slabs all the way across like this and then uh, before we close up the other side we need to place clay blocks inside of here so we don't have like a giant hole like that and fill in the rest stone slabs like so all right then we're going to add some more detail in the back let's add twin lights right above the door which is um, an open birch fence gate then we're going to take dark oak wood buttons add that to the edges on the sides and we're going to add one more to this side in the middle like so so for our last detail we're going to take a sign and place that right in front of this stone slab right above the windows and yeah that's pretty much it for the New Jersey Transit Alstom PL42 AC diesel electric locomotive in Minecraft. I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you do remember to hit that like button down below and subscribe if you haven't already because I will be uploading more videos like this in the future and I will see you guys next time. Bye.